Hello there. Just another quick video on Sony Vegas Movie Studio HD 11. Uh, I've noticed uh, a couple of people out there had some problems with the computer itself freezing and, you know, crashing. And uh, when I edit long videos, it does slow the computer down. Um, I'm running probably not probably under the minimum requirements for the software and uh, you know after editing especially when you're into it for a couple hours it does tend to slow down and crash on you so my suggestion is and it's bailed me out when I've used Pinnacle which crashes even more um, after I go in there and uh, uh, swear at my computer because things aren't where I last put them but you know say I import um, video files like I'm doing now I'm gonna you know say I'm gonna make a, a video here okay um, first thing I do I got my files imported that I want to make my video out of I go up to project save as go down here and name my project and click save okay that way let's say this freezes boom it's gone okay we'll start that back up again and uh, while this does have some crash recovery features it doesn't always work So what I'm going to do, if it doesn't already do it for me, is it automatically opens the last saved project. Um, so we'll make a couple changes here. Um, okay, that doesn't quite look right, but let's say that's what we want. Okay. While it does have auto save. I would suggest to you when you make a major change like dropping in all these files like this just go up here to the save button and click save it only takes a couple seconds and then if you want you go and rearrange your files um, it doesn't hurt to go up there and you know every minute or you know every couple changes it can be a pain in the ass but if you are working on a large file and you make a change, you know, such as shortening it and moving the other files, yeah, just click save. Yeah. Same thing if you're splitting a file like this and you want to take a segment out. You know, who wants to go back, uh, go back in there? and re-edit it. So I made a major change and I go up and hit save and, it, and it's all there. Oops, there we go. And after, even before you click make movie, when it's all done, click save just in the rare case that this does not come up or does not render correctly the project is saved and um, you shouldn't have any more issues with that thanks for watching and uh, have a good one